If you use AI to get drums, bass, or guitar tracks, you may run into the issue where the mix won't allow for the AI to get the instrument you're looking for or has an AI feel to the sound. Here's an example. Then stick around to the end of the video because I have tips that can help turn that same beat using AI into something sounding more like this. First, I did want to start and say that if you buy a MIDI for any of these instruments nowadays, it'll probably be the best quality backing track you can get. And if your drums don't sound as good as the track you're going for, you can use triggers and mic settings to help out. First, you want to go to YouTube and see if someone already did the hard work and uploaded a backing track for the instrument you're looking for. But if you're here, most likely you can't. So let's talk about the most popular tool used for splitting stems, and that's Moises.ai. And I find this tool great, but it's inconsistent. Instead, look at Tool Splitter AI. The only downside is you only get one download a day without a subscription. Something I don't think people have considered is song covers. When someone covers a song, it tends to make it easy for the AI to pull out the stem, and you can just credit the musician you sampled, and it's a win-win for both of you. And if you're really in a pinch and you want to get decent quality backing tracks, I recommend Ease US Stem Splitter. And if they hit you with a paywall, you can just screen record with Streamlabs or any other software. I hope this helps. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And links to all the websites below.